Hi Army, hi everyone. I just want to upload a short video. Is he feeling your connection or disconnection right now? You see three piles, pile one, pile two, pile three. Please choose from the colors of the of the little note. Pile one, pile two, or choose if you're drawn to an, a pile number. Pile three, okay. And we're in the universe right now again. So I changed decorations. I hope you like it, guys. And um, yes, so let's do this short reading. And please, guys, subscribe to my channel. Please also comment and like the video as always. That was very nice. And if you want to have private readings, guys, please contact me um, on my email. It's in the description box. Um, right now I give discount for 40 minute readings and 30 minute readings. So please contact me and we can discuss it there. Okay. Okay, guys. So let's start the reading. So hi, guys. Let's start pile one. We will read the quote at the end. The beautiful quote. So let's see what we have. We have wisdom here. We have trust. I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. Wow. Oh, wow. We have the King of Cups. Wow. Look at this veins. Look at this army. Oh my gosh. I haven't even seen this before in this picture. This reminds me so much of Dan. Look at this veins. Wow. Oh my God. We have the Knight of Cups. That's a couple guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. And we have beauty. So yes. He's feeling this connection. Wow. So let me read the cards for you. This is so beautiful. <clears throat> this is a couple, guys. It's a beautiful couple. Number 40. Here is number 45, which means it's nine. Um, so each one of you is separated from each other. But um, yes, you have a deep soul bond and um, this is a couple. We have the King of Cups and I just said this is the Divine Masculine and he looks very confident. Look how confident he looks. And um, the knight, uh, the King of Cups and the Knight of Cups, you see how you are sending, um, like you are sending out signs, you know, you're waiting desperately for your Masculine to notice you. Look how beautiful this is. Oh my gosh, I could cry right now. This is so beautiful. She's sending out all the light. He's receiving it. Look at this. He's authentic. He's like partly covered because he cannot show his whole, but he shows his nakedness. And especially this tattoo. Look at this tattoo. This tattoo is a sign he notices it. This is totally a sign for me. This tattoo is the sign. So he knows. <clears throat> and also the card trust. You know, the universe is saying, well, trust your inner voice. If you feel that he notices you, then yes, you can trust it, you know. And it's all about beauty. So what I think, and look how this rose is shining. It's like for him, you are the most beautiful rose, even if he doesn't know you. Because he knows you're the one, you know, the four is all about marriage, stability, and also here the Hierophant, this is about marriage. What I feel here is that this couple here is um, destined to come together because this is a marriage, this is home, okay? The Hierophant is all about rules, about... Um, society and everything you know and it's about change and it's all about home so this is creating a beautiful home both of them will create a beautiful home so wow this is so beautiful this is so beautiful both of um you know if you are the divine feminine and this is your divine masculine 
both of you are so beautiful personalities like really beautiful very loving um the cups energy is water energy so both of you could be pisces cancer scorpio or could you could have this in your chart you know very loving persons though the king of cups is one a very loving gentle compassionate soul and also the knight of cups the knight of cups wants to give her cup she wants to give her cup and you see this here how she earns how she yearns how she yearns for her divine masculine and this is the divine masculine yes he's receiving it and he's thinking this is the beauty most beautiful rose for him even if you don't know each other guys look at this this is mirroring in the cards this is destined to come together so let's see what else it's saying <clears throat> somehow we are all connected and so i know someday i will find you oh gosh and look at this quote believe in yourself i chose the um it randomly you know i channeled this once <clears throat> and i chose this randomly for the piles and this is so beautiful oh my gosh Someday I will find you, he's saying. So he's looking out for you guys. He's feeling you. This is a very strong soul bond. This is twin flame. Because I see the flame here. I see the flame here. This is written in the book of destiny. You see this here? He, this is the Hierophant. He carries the book of destiny. This love is written in the book of destiny. This love will come true in real life. This is so beautiful. Okay, Pi one. So beautiful. But always think about this is a general reading. Okay, guys? So that's all what I'm having. Bye, guys. Hi, pile two. So next up is pile, is your pile. So we look at this at the end. So I chose this randomly, you know, for the piles. Um, I asked Spirit to give me mandalas and pictures. So to, to um, have a channeled message at the end of the reading. Okay, so... Let's see what we're having here. We have, oh wow, <laughs> well, if the first card comes out and it's triumphant success, then yes, he's feeling you. But he's feeling chaos. There are the two tarot cards. I was thinking, where are the two tarot cards? They're missing. <laughs> he's feeling some kind of chaos. It's a judgment. I understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges. <clears throat> Wow. Wow, we have the king of swords holding the sword. Oh my god. Look at this, guys. Wow, look at this person. I mean, wow. I'm just wow. <clears throat> and the nine of pentacles, that's your energy. Look how beautiful. You're like in winter standing there waiting. That looks like a painting, guys. Wow, I've never seen this card. This is beautiful. Oh my god. This is so beautiful. <clears throat> okay, guys. Um, what I'm feeling here is that your person is very rational. Your person is a person that is a thinker. Your person is not a person that's believing in the universe. So this thought process here let me put this so because your person is a thinker you know <clears throat> your person changed a lot i see a lot of transformation here the king of swords could be a lawyer it could be a gemini libra aquarius personality but i see your person as being very logical okay they don't believe in things they don't know so um, <clears throat> I think what happened is that he feels you right now. And because we see that on this card, it's like the universe put a new thought in his head, you know. And this is between two worlds. This is two worlds for him. This is the one thought, you know. It's like, look how this head is like a zombie coming out of the ground. <laughs> this is so funny. It's, it looks like, you know, this um, this sword is a light bringer. The sword of light bringer. So I think your person just awakened to you. So the universe put this new thought in his head. And he's a logical person. He's not someone who's awakened a long, for a long time. So this is an awakening process. This is the universe bringing this 
<clears throat> bringing you into his life, in his, into his mind. Like he just realized that. And this is like the judgment card. This is the same as this card. Let's put those together. It says, I understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges. And this is a challenge for him. This is like judgment is when, the, when something is coming up, a new thought, a new idea. So <clears throat> he got this new thought and this new idea. And this is bringing chaos into his mind. Because as I told you, look at his, this air energy. This guy is very airy. This is air energy. This is air energy. The judgment is air energy. Um, this guy is very much logic, um, strategizing, making plans. It's not a person that's like going with their feelings, you know. They have to strategize, they have to plan. <clears throat> I think they also judge a lot things. They judge a lot. So when this thought came into their life, they were like, no. This is the pile where they go like, no, this can't be. Um, both of you are single. We have the nine and the nine. So this, you are not together with this person. You could have been in the past. <clears throat> so they have a new mind process. They changed. Look at this. If you were together with this person in the past, their whole mindset has changed. And now they see you as this wonderful queen. Look at this. It's like the ice queen, the queen of swords. If I look at this, it's not the Queen of Swords um, coming up in tarot, but she looks like the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Swords is usually always depicted in winter because she's also very logical and she's um, she has lived a lot in life. She has experienced a lot in life and the Queen of Swords, um, I usually feel her also <clears throat> in her older years. So and I see uh, autumn here, I see leaves, so you could be older than your guy, but this is a couple guys. I see the King of Swords and this is for me the Queen of Swords. So I see definitely a couple here. But <clears throat> he sees this reflection of you. So I think this is, he gets this in, in daydreaming and everything. And if, if you guys have met, then he sees you, he daydreams of you a lot. If you have never met, he sees you in dreams, okay? <clears throat> and this brings chaos into his life because you're the one for him. This is like bringing chaos because this is a whole new mindset coming into his life. And yes, he's feeling you, but this guy needs some processing time. Okay. This is like really bringing him out of balance, you know, but at the end we have to drive a triumphant success. So yes, he will be successful. He will um, be successful in this, in conquering this new thought and in processing this new thought. But this guy needs time. This guy needs time. You just, you just popped up in his life, in his mind, you know? Wow. So let's see what the quote is saying. <clears throat> we are protected. I know that, but I just to be, wish to be with you. Wow. This is so cool. Yeah, they see, they see you as their wish. And this eyes also see the mind. Um, it's like they get this thought, thought in their mind that they, that you kind of guys, you guys are connected. And um, he wishes to be with you. He cannot grasp, really. It's like <clears throat> this guy's thinking, well, if this woman is not in my life, then this what what the kind of connection is this? It's like he, it's hard for him to process. And you see how the universe, because the purple is the universe, how the judgment, how the universe is coming into his life and bringing him this new thought process. It's like the purple taking over, over this blue and rational thinking of this guy. So, <clears throat> yeah, this will be successful and you will hear from this person. But, um, you know, this is very tumultuous for this person. But it's really beautiful. And um, yes, he's feeling you, okay? Because this was our question. Okay, guys, so this was all I'm having. Um, thank you for listening. Please like and, like and subscribe. And I say bye. So, hi, Pi 3. Welcome to the universe. This is your reading. So we look at the quote later. I channeled some quotes, you know, already um, some time ago. And I put the channeling I did to the piles, you know, so we will look at this later. So let's see what it is saying. It says patience and planning. This is like spirit coming in. Look at this. Those are the yin and the yang. <clears throat> Purpose. 
I know what I'm here to do. Wow. There's a life purpose involved. Something with work. Focus. Wow. Number 17. Let's hope. <clears throat> Very interesting. So let's see what the tarot is saying. We have the six of wands. Beautiful woman. Beautiful picture. <clears throat> oh my gosh. And we have the king of pentacles. An earth sign. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. <clears throat> Wow. Well, if I see the six of uh, wands here, that's all about success. So your person is definitely a successful person. Um, very focused on their life purpose. Very focused, a very patient, passionate and planning personality that fits to the king of pentacle, pentacles. Um, who is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn, you know. Um <clears throat> But I see here that you are also very focused on shooting them. You know, see this? So they, do they feel you right now? Yes, they feel you. And they're working on their soul task. Like they are really working hard. You see this king of pentacles. Um, you're not together with this person. Like all my three piles people are not together. This is like a soldier. Look at this. This is like a soldier. This guy. Doesn't he look like a soldier? He's like, uh, like when I see this, how he looks like in the 7th century, I feel past life here, guys. I feel strongly past life connection. You have known each other from a past life. I strongly feel this 17th century. Also here, there's a purpose you guys, you guys come together in this life. And yes, he feels you. The Six of Wands is all about success. Um, <clears throat> he strongly feels you, yeah. There is a purpose of you guys coming together in this life. And I think you guys have spent many lifetimes together. I know what I'm here to do. Um, this person is already in their soul task. Because you see the mandala is, is um, purple. It's Everything here is really much purple. The woman even looks. like Look at her, the surroundings of the card. It's purple. So <clears throat> they know you're destined from the universe. They know you're destined from the universe. But um, until you guys meet, you know, you are twin flames. I see this here. There are twins. <clears throat> and I know on my channel, I always get the twin flames cards. So it's not, it's not um, an uncommon thing that I have all the twin flames um, here on my channel. So I feel he strongly feels this bond. Um, it's shining the light on him. He knows that something beautiful from the universe... But he knows it takes some time till you come together because he's right now very focused on his workplace. Um, so this guy, whoever this is, very focused on his soul task. He knows he cannot be with you right now and he knows there is more patience um, involved because he's right now working on his soul task. He's very focused. He's very focused on work. And with his work, he is fulfilling some kind of soul purpose. And yes, he's feeling you and this is very successful for him. This connection uh, brings this guy a lot of inspiration, okay? A lot of focusing, a lot of inspiration. And with this connection, he's fulfilling his soul purpose. So it could be that through this connection with you, he's like really in his work. Like he's working upon this inspiration, you know? Beautiful. He could be someone, you know, very focused, like a sportsman, like, a, like, you know, someone doing sports. I see he lives in a castle. This is very, someone who's very protected by spirit and also by his surrounding. You cannot easily get to this person because they're locked behind this castle here. They're working on the soul task and... Yeah, this soul connection gives him all the inspiration he needs for his um, for his work. Okay, beautiful. So let's see what the card is saying. You have no idea how often I sprinkle color on a canvas and thoughts of you. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. 
you guys remember this quote. I channeled this quote. I had it in a lot of readings already. Um, this inspi is inspiring for him. As I said before, your connection, um, he's using for his creativity. He's using for his creative pro process. That's why he's feeling you right now. He must feel you right now. The universe is bringing you in, in his feelings, in his daydreams, in his dreaming, um, so that he can get creative. This is a person that works with the art. So it could be a sportsman, but it also could be an artist. Um, this is, you are his muse, okay? You are this muse of the sky and he's working on with that. That's so beautiful. All those three piles are, oh my gosh, it's so, so beautiful. Okay, pile three. So that was just a short reading I wanted to do to, um, you know, to go with you into the universe tonight. And um, yeah, guys, I love you. Please take care of yourself. And if you want a private reading, please contact me. Okay. And I say bye.